हरे कृष्णा नो वन हैज़ अ राइट टू मिसट्रीट यू नॉट इवन यू सपोज समबडी मिसट्रीट्स अस दे कॉल अस फॉर अ मीटिंग एंड देन दे जस्ट निगलेक्ट अस और दे आर वेरी लेट और दे कॉन्स्टेंटली डिस्पराज अस ह्यूमिलिएटिंग अस और डिमिनिमाइजिंग अस then we would say how dare you mistreat me like this i'm not going to stand this so now it's not only people outside us who can mistreat us even we can mistreat ourselves that means that we can be our worst enemies we can end up we we can say we can something within us prompts us do this and then we listen to it and then we spend hours and hours on something which is utterly useless or sometimes we just criticize ourselves like a haranch you know ruthlessly and we end up demoralized by that now we need to treat ourselves like someone we are responsible for someone whose abilities and talents need to be engaged constructively so that we can move on in our lives positively we can make the best of what we have and the bhagavad gita points to this dynamic when it states in 65 uddhare datmana atmanam natmanam avasadayet atmai vaya atmano bandhur atmai var puratmanah uddhare atmana atmanam we need to elevate ourselves with ourselves not degrade ourselves with ourselves one way we degrade ourselves is by mistreating ourselves now the opposite of mistreating is not pampering it is treating respectfully and responsibly that means that it's not pampering oh you are terrible or oh, you are wonderful everything that you do is perfect not like that just like a coach is responsible for a uh, for a trainee but the coach also needs to be respectful to the trainee but the coach can't pamper the trainee and can not can the coach insult the trainee so like that we need to become our own coaches and we need to see how the voice inside us which we can call the voice of our mind how it is acting is it pampering us it is it is it disparaging us or is it telling us something useful and then based on merit when we learn to act in ways according to our inner guy counts inner voice often with in consultation with our outer wise voices when we act in a way that we elevate ourselves then we can manifest our full potential we can fulfill our destiny and we can act according to the dignity of the parts of god that we are intrinsically so don't we refuse to let the world mistreat us we resent it we revolt against it similarly we need to revolt against to be mistreating ourselves and learn to treat ourselves not by pampering not by disparaging but by respecting and being responsible for to unleash our potential thank you hare krishna